Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Widgets and Wonders, my show about great products from small companies. Now this is a close to home one today. Um, Mike at Epic Duck Studios has been doing some 3D sculpting. He was sick for a while and so he wasn't streaming, he didn't feel well. And so he dove back into making stuff. And besides making some crazy things, he made like a... Uh, a, like weird Halloween-y bits and bob that, that people really liked. He's also made some really cool buildings. These are generic buildings um, in like sort of a street style. They're a corner building, but they could fit easily in a square as well. And they're stackable, so you can make them as big or tall as you want. And they're available on my mini factory um, right now. So he printed a couple for me so I could see them and show them to you guys. Uh, and they are basically been scaled here for um, Marvel Crisis Protocol, but you easily use them for Infinity. You could use them for Perilous Tales, lots of indie games, um, really anything. They're just kind of like a cool corner storefront, and he's planning on doing more in the future if this is something that people like. So let's take a look. I put some minis down so you can see them in scale. Uh, has he scaled them for the printer? I think they come pre-scaled like this with the assumption that people want to use them for that game. Uh, but you can obviously make them bigger or smaller. They're printed in a gray FDM. So let's have a look. So here's Mike's buildings all done up with some minis uh, from Crisis Protocol. And obviously there are three main components here. Well, it's like four actually. There's two rooftops. Uh, one which has some billboarding on it. One which does not. They're effectively the same otherwise. Uh, there's some second or first floors. You can see they do have a detailed window interior, which is nice. So if you do want to use these uh, for games where like you require an interior, you want to take the roofs off and stuff like that, you can. Um, and then there's a ground floor piece. And the ground floor piece also has some little details like a front door and back door access uh, and like some little electric meter and lighting and stuff as well. Uh, and they all stack. So they're all interchangeable. They have a nice little locking stack system with like a tongue and grooves. So they can go on top of each other and you can either make them super tall. So you can make this a three story building if you want and use one of the two rooftops or I could just have this be a second story or, or even just an expansion, right? So I could have this stack up against this wall like so, right? Have them kitty corner and then have that rooftop on top like that and have it be one single building. So lots of options here. Uh, printed in FDM, so I don't know what the print time was. I'll, I'll ask Mike and I'll put that in the video description and I'll link it on my mini factory. So there it is, printable train from Epic Duck Studios. Hey there, I hope you enjoyed that video. There are tons of other games already recorded for you to watch. Click over to my channel page if you haven't already and have a look to the dozens of playlists full of videos. I guarantee you'll discover a game you haven't seen played before. I put out new videos seven days a week and every day is themed to a different genre as I continue to explore the wider world of gaming. Of course, none of that's possible without you, the viewer, so click a like and subscribe if you'd like to stay on top of what's happening here daily. My two kids and I are massively grateful to be able to have the flexibility of this job so I can always maximize my time with them. If you want to support me continuing to put out this content, it's only possible because of my amazing backers on Patreon who support the studio, equipment, and model cost, as well as being how I make the bulk of my living. You can also help out by buying a t-shirt through Spreadshirt, a measuring gauge or widget from Death Ray Designs, or buying one of my games and supplements like Last Days, Gamma Wolves, and Blaster. As a way of showing my appreciation, patrons get early access to new games and supplements that I write throughout the course of the year. Huge thanks for watching, it really does help out, and happy gaming.